Howdy. I'm going to show you how I grill coho salmon. The first thing I do is soak a cedar shingle in water for an hour. Next, lay out your coho fillet on the thicker end of the water soaked cedar shingle. Now, apply a slather of ginger to the fillet. If you are a purist, you can mush mush up some fresh ginger. I don't. I use gourmet garden ginger spice blend from the grocery store. So, this photo shows how the ginger is slathered all over the fillet. Next, I sprinkle some turbinado sugar all over the slathered ginger. In the closed grill, this sugar is going to caramelize in the heat. Ooh la la! As a last step, I spray some liquid butter on the fillet to better bind the ginger and the turbinado sugar. Now this is where I start to drool. This is what it looks like when I've placed the planked salmon on the grill over two burners set to medium. A fillet this size usually takes about 25 to 30 minutes to bake. Here it is after 10 minutes or so. You can see the magic beginning to happen. I keep a bottle of water in a sprayer handy just in case the plank starts smoldering too much. I'm opening the hood more often than otherwise so you can see what's going on. When you got quality coho like this it's important not to overcook it. Well, if by now you must have started drooling with me. Notice how the smoldering from the plank has put a little patina scab of smoke on this coho fillet. Why, this looks sappy. It's time to take it off the grill and enjoy. Here you have it. Prime coho grilled on a smoldering soaked cedar plank. A salad on the side. Chardonnay to clear the palate. Bon appetit. This is a patty production.